NASA has gotten a notice from Inuit and Native American senior citizens that the world is experiencing a shaft move and their sky has changed. Senior citizens have seen that the sun has been ascending in an alternate position and that their sunlight hours for chasing have been delayed. The climate has likewise turned out to be erratic. The Inuits have likewise announced that as the sun changed position as well as the moon and stars have as well, and they all affect temperature and wind which makes climate forecast, basic to their vocations, more troublesome. Is an inversion of the world's attractive posts occurring? Volcanoes. Quakes. Peculiar clamors from the ocean. New stunning confirmation focuses to a post move which, on the off chance that it happens quick, will cause disarray the world over. It has been logically demonstrated that the Earth experiences a full geomagnetic inversion, or post move, around at regular intervals. These inversions are normally moderate, happening bit by bit finished yearns ranges of time. In any case, Toward the begin of the 20th century that verifiable example seems to have been profoundly adjusted. A post-inversion, when the world's north and south attractive shafts begin to swap places, switching the world's attractive extremity, has happened ordinarily sometime recently. Researchers who track the historical backdrop of the planet have recognized 74 of these occasions by contemplating center specimens. These are separated from hundreds or thousands of feet down in the ground and in the thick polar ice. A sudden move would toss the world's offset so remarkably it could trigger deadly seismic tremors, tidal wave on a scale we can scarcely envision equipped for washing ideal over the United States and each other significant landmass, volcanic emissions so expansive and boundless that the subsequent cinder mists and gases could cover the sun's beams and trigger another sudden ice age. Researchers search for proof of past Armageddon-style demolition by recognizing tumultuous silt where limit layers of earth, shake and ice record weirdo occasions in the world's history as groups of mud and small attractively charged sections. To researchers, these are clear pointers of sudden surges, ice liquefy or fiery remains stores. At the point when this is found outside a long stretch of the cycle of solidifying and softening in the world's history, it is a marker of a shaft move. Shaft shifts cause a noteworthy increment in the development of the structural plates, the monster lines of restricting splits in the world's hull which push and granulate against each other until the point when they occasionally discharge like a bald clench hand in a shut palm flicking upwards. There are presently signs among the sharp increment in catastrophic events and other unusual, clearly random occurrences which point towards a conceivable inversion. It is generally perceived that attractive north that point at the highest point of the globe which compasses and gadgets which rely upon attractive route depend, is moving progressively rapidly towards Russia from its present position above Greenland and closer to Canada. It has moved 400 kilometers in the most recent decade and is quickening. Our sun swaps its north and south shaft each 11-13 years and has recently done as such. The impact on the sun is to fortify the number and power of sunlight-based tempests which can majorly affect the Earth. They can meddle with television transmissions and power supplies. Different signs which may show the impacts of an attractive inversion between attractive north and south are remarkable seven volcanoes which have begun to emit far and wide over the most recent couple of days, and a noteworthy spike of 7.0 extent in addition to seismic tremors all of which I have seen actually a couple of days after the occasion as a narrative producer. The cycle began in Indonesia in 2004 and happened again as of late in Nepal. These sharp increments in seismic action do happen at regular intervals or somewhere in the vicinity and might be a piece of a characteristic back and forth movement however they are another part of what could be a noteworthy pattern in the light of the tireless and animating walk of attractive northeast far from its unique position. USGS and NASA are extremely worried about another magma chamber the University of Utah have found as of late under Yellowstone National Park notwithstanding the tremendous pool of liquid shake and iron they definitely thought about. This one is a shocking 11 times the volume of the Grand Canyon. A sudden post move could turn into the push the magma chamber with the surface territory of Los Angeles needs to explode. In the event that it does, the vast majority of North America would be crushed in a flash and another ice age would start.
Another story which makes one wonder what on earth is going on is a 300 meter, 900 feet, high island which has showed up from the ocean bed only north of the tip of Japan in only one night. This range was the starting point of the 8.9 magnitude seismic tremor which tore through Japan in 2011, causing one of the most exceedingly awful tidal wave ever. Segments of crustal plates which abruptly move under huge warmth and weight which cause seismic tremors and wave have been known to move drastically, despite the fact that it is regularly never observed as it happens miles down on the seabed. Another rack 800 kilometers, 500 miles and 60 meter, 180 feet high, showed up off the west bank of Indonesia in 2004 which set off the notorious tidal wave which cleared totally round the world's boundary three times. The new Japanese landmass showed up at the very same time as the Nepal 7.7 .7 magnitude seismic tremor that occurred 5,000 kilometers, 3,000 miles, away at the inverse end of the Eurasian structural plate. At long last the most abnormal record of nature carrying on peculiarly are reports of an odd murmuring commotion originating from the ocean. Researchers have clarified this as the impact of the streams running however the seas, 